Welcome to our Samsoi Po tour. Wait, we actually went to the ex Samsoi Po service reservoir guided tour prior to this clip. Here's the footage. Waiting our turn now. The reservoir was completed in 1904 to service residents of Kowloon Tong, Samsui Po, and Taihan Tong. It was declared a Grade 1 historic building in 2021. It has a Romanesque architecture, a building style which was thought to have arrived in Hong Kong from Britain, who inherited it from ancient Rome. So where are we going to go eat? Chen Fa Min Gun. We're going to Chen Fa Min Gun and they were opened in 1950 something and it is a Dai Pai Dong and now they've actually refurbished it so it's supposed to be nicer. What are they known for? Fish balls. Pig trotters, they're handmade fish balls, handmade cuttlefish balls. Oh no, are they opened? <laughs> I know, that's another story. Oh, <laughs> it's open. Okay. And also the soy sauce is like the sweet dark soy sauce. It's actually pretty good. Not bad. And then when you order dry noodle, they usually give you a cup of like whatever soup that you have. We also got their they're supposed to be sauda, like so they smack it themselves, the fish balls, and they smack it themselves the cuttlefish. Okay, we're gonna try the fish ball now. The fish one, you can taste the fish. Which is funny, but usually sometimes they put so much filler, but they, you can actually taste that they use fish. Let's try the cuttlefish. It's the ma thai. It gives a nice crunch. Mm. It has the chestnut, and then also it has like, I would say, is it han choy? The Chinese chives? It's actually quite nice together. It's a nice texture too. Mm. Mm -hmm. Actually, we left it for a long time because we were taking photos and it's still pretty sad now. And then we're gonna try my pig trotters, which they're famous for. I know it's really good because it's falling off the bone already. Look at that. This is gonna be collagen for my skin. It's definitely very, very soft. I can feel the collagen coming onto my skin now. So. Yeah, it's good. Yay! I think of total fishy gold. The, the chi is it called Chinese celery? And then the chestnut together is quite nice. Oh, I heard they make their own chili oil. It's my favorite. It's called Yu Zhao Gai. This is for if you want to go crafting. They have a lot of materials, cloth, good for Halloween, scrapbooking, things like that. Bong. Here when he was young. This one. <laughs> you can recognize this. Holy cow. Oh, this is new stuff. I want coffee. What kind of coffee? Oh. You are right. The ice cream so shop opens at 2. I am right. Did you hear those words coming out of her mouth? I love it. <laughs> wow, your flower is so nice. I can only do one. 
Okay, so no ice cream, but this ice cream place is really cool because they use like Cantonese flavors and stuff like red bean ice cream. I have tofu ice cream with mala, like spicy chili oil <laughs> with a red bean popsicle. She went and got the pineapple slash with um, salted lime and then also a plum popsicle. But it was cool, it's not open, so we are going to go back home. But I will see her again in the evening for a private kitchen. What, what time is it right now? Two. Two. We will see you at six. Six. Here, not gonna lie, I was running a little bit late. I had two and a half hours at home. Oh my god, my hair. So we're here. We're here for a Hakka dinner. Actually, I get takeout a lot from here for lunch. Never been here for dinner though. I'm the first one here, yay! Hey, hey, look who just walked in the door. Hey, 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 I'm ahead of you. Maybe, so? What, how does that, why does that matter? Yay! We're doing, um, it's called a private kitchen. Usually when it's a private kitchen, it means they're not licensed and then you go up to like someone sketchy's house to eat it. <laughs> but we're actually at a restaurant today. See if I'm trying my goggles on. Usually it's like, oh my. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But how would you, how would you describe what a private kitchen is? It's an exclusive private kitchen. Okay, fine. <laughs> Lots of time, the ones I've been to, they're like sketchy and they're like not licensed in those like industrial buildings. Anyways, uh, we're doing a Hakka cuisine today and then we have the abalone in Padu and then so is the egg. It's in alcohol. You guys have been eating a lot of the radish, which I'm gonna give a try. Oh, This is fish skin. They just fried it. So a lot of times when you go to fish bowl places, they always have to show. Uh, uh, Oh, cumin. They're saying that there's a lot of cumin in this. Mmm. I don't think I can do ASMR. I'm not very good at it. My favorite. This is like when you go to those banquets with some sauce. Mmm. Oh, it's so cool. It's so what is it? Is it potato? Fruit salad. It's a fruit salad? Oh, interesting. This is what my full mom likes to make. With the salad dressing. I like dumplings. I just don't like cream. Hi, <laughs> man. I like the different bits inside. Hey, we're going in. Do you like white meat or do you like dark meat? It's actually not very salty for so much soy sauce. Can I tell you a thing about, you don't eat mushrooms, right? I was born in the Thai and then I was born in Thai. So ever since then, I can't eat Thai. Oh, I want to ask you. Okay, so this is called peach gum. And then this is food, which is bean curd, and then they just like boiled it down until it's um, a soup. And this is their dessert. Food Tongsai, standard. Let's try their peach. It's supposed to be good for your skin, right? It's like collagen. Everything is for collagen. <laughs> we finished with dinner, but after dinner, there's always dessert. So we're going to eat Tong Yun. <laughs> we are headed towards this one. You met Fok Yun, Tong Yun. Okay, we've got a peanut black sesame. Come with salt, eh? Is it is it ginger? Mm. This place is Michelin starred. Never even knew that, but it's famous around this neighborhood. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you enjoy your own dessert. If there's black stuff on here, I apologize. Have a great day, and don't forget, what's the weather like in Hong Kong? Well, it's humid with a chance of visuals. Mm. Oh, no, 
vào con phong ê